Hello and welcome to the 16th tutorial in the Cocos 2DX version 3C++ tutorial series and in this tutorial we're going to look at rotating using the rotate to action. This tutorial assumes you've done tutorial 5, if you haven't don't worry there will be a link in the description or you just implement it directly into your own project. Also there will be another link in the description to the source code produced from this tutorial. So I'm just going to go ahead and open up our project. So what we want to do is just add an action. And it's going to do auto action equals rotate to colon colon create. Now we can specify a few properties. We can specify the duration of the action, the angle of the rotation in the x, y, or just the general rotation. We're just going to put the general rotation. So if we just put three for this and we can get rid of both parameters, we just need the one. And I'm gonna put 90 degrees. Semicolon, now to run this action from my sprite. Run action, action. You might be thinking, what does rotate do? Kind of in the name, it rotates it, but it rotates it to a certain angle. So if, for example, it was at 45 degrees, it, it would only rotate it 45 degrees because the angle between 45 and 90 is 45. Whereas the rotate by rotates it by a certain amount relative to what it is at the time of calling the action. So let's just run this. There you go, it rotated by 90 degrees, or should I say 290 degrees, over a period of 3 seconds. So that's the rotate to action done. That's it for this tutorial. In the next tutorial, we're going to look at tinting using the tint by action. If you have any questions, feel free to message us at support at sonosystem.uk or comment or just message us via YouTube. All the required links for the source code will be in the description. And as usual, thanks for watching and have a nice day.